hello guys welcome back to my channel today i'm going to show you something useful that you will not regret after watching this video you know i used to shave my hair or cut my hair like once in two weeks and by then i should have had enough dandruff on my hair and also whenever i shave i used to have a vegetated hair bones and the rest on my jaw on parts of my neck but ever since i made use of this natural remedy which i prepared myself i haven't experienced that for a very long time now but today i want to show you how to make the remedy which i'll be using for some time now but before i do that i want to ask you is this your first time of staying my channel to watch my videos if this is your first time of staying my channel to watch my videos i'll say welcome to my channel and thank you for watching my videos but if this is not your first time of visiting my channel to watch my videos i'll ask that you kindly consider subscribing to my channel if you've not done so please kindly hit the red subscribe button on your right hand side below the video and equally click on the notification bell for you to have educative updates whenever i post new videos and for you to equally be among the first set of people to be notified whenever i post new videos should you have found this video or should you find this video worthy at the end of the watch kindly give it a thumbs up and likewise consider sharing it with your friends and wonderful families because i know a lot of people have the problems on their skin some people have ringworm some people have dandruff in invaded hair and the bombs and the rest so this is the natural way to take care of all those mentions just stay glued and watch how to prepare the remedy yourself it's very very useful just stay glued in order not to waste much of our time i have coconut oil which i'm going to make use of this is very necessary for this natural remedy i equally have a spoon I love using my golden teaspoon, this teaspoon to stir the remedy and you know this I'm going to mix up this to stir the remedy properly and finally I have neem leaf I've already uh, ground this I blended the neem leaf in a blender which I got this so this is enough for what I'm on, I want to do today how do I prepare my remedy? I'll add some quantity of the coconut oil into the dim leaf. Depending on the quantity of dim leaf you are using, so just have something that will, will be enough to cover this and something that you have extract from it. So I'm going to put the one that can cover this so this will depend on the quantity of the new leaf three it's not yet enough you can see four so i'm going to use five teaspoon five this is what i have I'm done with this so I'm going to stir this and this I will cover this and keep it for at least at least three to seven days to allow the oil dissolve properly in the neem leaf I'll keep this for about three to seven days depending on when you you need to be checking it every day from three days you can check if it has properly dissolved i'll keep this for about three to seven days to allow it dissolve properly so after that what i'll do is to strain the oil that's the coconut oil from the neem leaf. I want to just separate the shaft from the liquid. I'll just strain it to get the dissolved neem leaf in the coconut oil. By then, the color must have changed and the potency of the neem leaf was already in the oil. So, 
I'll keep this for three to seven days. I'll be checking from the third day, I'll be checking how the dissolution has been. But finally, finally, my result for the seven days is this. After I strained this from the substance, that's from the, from the mixture, this is the dissolved oil. The dissolved coconut oil in neem leaf this is how this is the color this is how it looks like this is what i'm going to be making use of every day morning and evening on my hair or any part that i have infection ringworm dandruff and the rest any skin infection i will just make use of this let's let me just show you how i apply this on my head okay this is now the dissolved mixture which has been strained the mixture so i have to apply this right away assuming i just finished cutting my hair i used to have dandruff before i started using this and i used to have invaginated hair and equally bones on my jaw and neck area so what i do immediately after i finish shaving or cutting my hair i just apply this that's what i used to do apply it properly on my head and properly on the jaw and neck area then if I equally have any skin rashes or anything on my body I apply it also and I do that morning and evening I do that every day until I notice results. I do that every day until I notice changes. I do that every day until I feel and I can see that the rashes, bumps, or ingrown hair, or, or dandruff has cleared off. And it has worked for me tremendously. And I know it will work for you too if you try it. It's not something of trial and error. I've used it and I keep using it. But, haven't seen this video? Haven't seen how I prepare the remedy and haven't seen how I demonstrate and use it myself? Have you finally considered subscribing to my channel? If you've not done so, Please kindly hit the red subscribe button on your right hand side below the video and equally click on the notification bell for you to have educative updates whenever I post new videos and for you to equally be among the first set of people to be notified whenever I post new videos. And should you have found this video worthy? kindly give it a thumbs up and this serves as a motivational factor for me to do more videos more useful videos and also should you have found this video worthy consider sharing this video with your friends and wonderful families because i know we all must have had infection bumps ingrown or impregnated hair ringworm and other skin diseases that will, you will need to make use of this natural remedy that you prepare yourself. It's very simple. You don't need to call me to prepare for you. You know the ingredients already and you see how simple to prepare them. So just stay glued to my channel and keep watching my wonderful videos which I'll bring your way every day. Visit my other videos to benefit from my former videos and still hope for better videos along the way. Thank you for watching my videos. Thank you for visiting my channel. Thank you for staying glued to Max Solutions. Thank you.